And the death of Professor Abani is not the end of the peace process. That was said by many Afghans, in particular by the highest authorities in Afghanistan. It is a moment for the Afghans to recalibrate, yes. A moment that calls for national unity among the leaders and people of Afghanistan as they are again uh, resisting another tragic loss. Peace is a process, not an event. A process in which, in order to be sustainable and deliver lasting results, must be broad-based, including Afghans of all kinds, including civil society. The priority must continue to be a dialogue among Afghans themselves, led by them, with non-Afghans, like all of us, playing a supportive role, if and when required. Despite our effort to stabilize our country, Afghans still suffer from endless campaign of terror carried out by Afghanistan's enemy. Over the past month, terrorists launched sophisticated attacks including raid on intercontinental hotel, the attacks on the NATO compound and U.S. embassy in Kabul, and a chain of targeted assassination of a number of Afghanistan prominent, prominent and high-profile national figures. The continuous spate of attacks, which originate from ter terrorist sanctuaries and safe havens beyond the, our borders, has generated an unprecedented level of anger and frustration among the wide spectrum of Afghan society. We tend to avoid a blame game even when militants cross over from the other side and attack our troops and innocent civilians. As stated by our foreign minister in the general debate on Tuesday, we must work closely and as responsible partners together in a cooperative matter and not rush to judgments or question each other's intentions. There is an investigation taking place. There are many theories about it. Once the investigation is concluded, and we will know, they will know, the Afghans, and they know how to find out that, trust me, what type of group of people was behind this, then there will be conclusions about who to talk to and how to proceed. But doing any type of speculation at this stage would be, frankly, premature.